Airborne aircraft carriers may sound like something out of a science fiction movie, but believe it or not, the USS Akron and the USS Macon were two rigid airships that were part of the Navy's ambitious project. These massive 800-foot-long dirigibles used helium to float through the skies. What made these airships truly unique were their built-in hangars, which allowed them to carry and launch up to five Curtis Sparrowhawk biplanes during flight. The planes were launched from a T-shaped opening in the bottom of the airship's hull. To retrieve them mid-air, a trapeze arm would be lowered, and a skyhook attached to the plane's wings would be seized. However, tragedy struck. In April 1933, the USS Akron crashed in high winds off the coast of New Jersey. And in February 1935, the USS Macon fell victim to a storm near California. These accidents resulted in the loss of approximately 75 crewmen and soon abandoned its flying aircraft carrier program. Instead, they turned their attention to non-rigid blimps, which proved to be safer and more reliable for their aerial operations. Thanks for watching.